Not satisfied with life, a tale of true happiness. I have learned to be content whatever the circumstances. I know what it is to be in need, and I know what it is to have plenty. I have learned the secret of being content in any and every situation. Philippians 4, 11 to 12. Once upon a time, a raven was very unhappy with his life. One day, he started crying while sitting on a branch of a tree. A monk was meditating beneath the tree when a drop of the raven's tears fell on his cheek. The monk looked up and saw the raven crying. The monk asked, What's the matter, my friend? Why are you crying? The raven replied, O oh, wise one, I am very upset with my life. No one loves me, people shoo me away in disgrace, no one gives me anything to eat, and everyone hates me. Death is better than such a life. Hearing the raven's words, the monk's heart was filled with compassion. He said, My friend, we should learn to be happy in whatever condition we are in. But the raven did not understand the wisdom of the monk and kept on crying. The monk then said, Don't be upset. Tell me, what do you want to be? I can make you that with my mantra. The raven became happy and said, O oh, blessed one, if you want to do me a favor, then please make me a swan. The monk said, Okay, I will make you a swan. First, go to a swan and ask him whether he is happy with his life or not. You go and find out, and I will wait for you here. The raven happily flew away to meet a swan. He saw a swan swimming in a pond and approached him. How beautiful you are. You are as white as milk. Everyone loves you. You must be the happiest bird in the world. The swan said to the raven with a sad heart, No, my friend, I am not happy. There are so many beautiful colors in the world, but I don't have any color. White is a nothing color. I think the parrot must be the happiest bird in the world. He is so colorful. Hearing this, the raven flew away and reached a parrot. He said to the parrot, O oh parrot, you are so colorful and beautiful. You must be the happiest bird in the world. The parrot said to the raven with a sad heart, No, my friend, I am not happy. People keep parrots in cages. I am always afraid that someone may catch me and lock me up. I think the peacock is the happiest bird in the world. He is much more colorful than me. Hearing this, the raven flew around looking for a peacock. After searching for a long time, he finally found a peacock in a cage in a zoo. He saw hundreds of people gathered to see the peacock. After the people left, the raven approached the peacock and said, Dear peacock, you are so beautiful. Every day, thousands of people come to see you. And look at me. When people see me, they immediately shoo me away. I think you must be the happiest bird on the planet. The peacock replied sadly, I always thought I was the most beautiful and happy bird on the planet. But because of my beauty, I am entrapped in this zoo. When people pluck my colorful feathers to make decorative things, it hurts me a lot. I am not happy. The raven was surprised to hear this from the peacock. He asked, If you are not happy, then whom do you think is the happiest bird in the world? Peacock said, I have examined the zoo very carefully and realized that you, the raven, are the only bird not kept in a cage. People don't try to catch you and entrap you. For the past few days, I have been thinking that if I were a raven, I could happily roam everywhere and be free. Hearing this, the raven flew away, feeling happy for the first time to be a raven. He returned to the monk and said, O oh, wise one, I do not want to be anything else. I am fine with what I am. Life Lesson you see our lives, you will find that this is our problem too. We make unnecessary comparisons with others and then become sad and curse ourselves. We don't appreciate what we have, leading to a vicious cycle of unhappiness. Learn to be happy with what you have instead of looking at what you don't have. There will always be someone who has more or less than you. If you keep comparing yourself to others, you will never be able to be happy. A person who is satisfied with what he or she has is the happiest person in the world. Thank you for watching and always keep smiling. May God bless you with contentment and joy.